Howdy there, folks! How are y'all doing? My name is Reese, and welcome back to our Tech It Legends 25 Challenge Let's Play Adventure, Episode 69, Feeling Fine. I know we haven't played this in quite a while. Uh, that wasn't a conscious choice. At the beginning of September, I recorded an episode, and it sat on a hard drive for about three weeks before I finally edited it and released it last week, I believe. So, uh, this is technically the first new episode, and... Uh, roughly a month. I was going through a weird time. So there's some stuff happening in my life. I was having a like a quarter-life existential crisis sort of situation where I was wondering who I am and what I'm doing and, and what's my purpose. And I, I just didn't feel like recording or editing, but I'm back now. And actually, during that time, I, I did start streaming a bit more over on twitch.tv slash howdyfolks. Link in the description of this video. So if you're not already following me on twitch.tv forward slash howdyfolks live, that live bit is important. That's why I always say link in the description, because sometimes I forget to say that part, and it's important that, you know, if you follow the link, you, you can't end up in the wrong place. Twitch.tv forward slash howdyfolkslive. Uh, you can go follow me there, you know, on Twitch. I, I do a live stream Tuesdays and Thursdays at about 7.30 p.m. Central Standard Time. So after I get off work, do my workout, do take a shower, you know, I stream for, for an hour and a half, a couple hours there, and then I stream every Saturday morning at 8 a.m. Central Standard Time. And I'm thinking about adding Sunday mornings before church to that, but I need to do it a couple of times consistently and, and feel confident before I announce that as like an official scheduled streams. But yeah, you know, follow me on Twitch if you wanna if you wanna see some fun, crazy antics. But we're back to recording videos now. We're back to doing editing. And I was looking through the comments on the last video. Now, like I said, it just came out last week, even though it is several weeks since I recorded it. And uh, there's a lot of really good comments there, but one in particular that I liked was Nicola J, who is water over on the Discord, uh, gave me some tips, you know, some pros and cons about gem armor, and then requested that I nuke myself while wearing it. And I thought, well, yeah, that sounds like a fun time. You know, we don't have anything else planned for this episode. Except now, I kind of do have something planned for this episode. I mean, this wasn't a, an intentional thing going in, but I need to get some lamps and go fill that in. So... This might be sort of like a golden opportunity to do something like a clock wipe. If I can center myself up right up in the middle of the room here, and I just look straight up. Oh, that would be a really cool clock wipe if I could get it, like, positioned correctly. How was that? Did that, did that transition correctly? Did that look good? I, don't, I, I won't know until I sit down to edit, but there we go. We've got this place completed now. It's a single giant box of just blinding whiteness. How bland! <laughs> Something else that was recommended was that we could implement the the bed on the floor by putting it down on just regular blocks and then breaking the blocks out from underneath it and putting glass in its place, which is something that, yeah, would definitely work. And I should have done, should have known. I didn't think about it. didn't occur to me at the time. I guess we can put blocks back underneath it, yeah? Yeah, okay, well, that's something we can do. Someone recommended building the carpenter's bed to customize it. I don't even know if that's a thing. Is there a carpenter's bed? I don't see it as an option, but maybe we should check in actual crafting recipes, not in things that we've already made, and don't shrek me sideways, there's a carpenter's bed. Alright, I think I can totally manage that. If I don't throw the objects that I'm collecting back into there by accident, then I can 100% manage a carpenter's bed. Now, one thing I don't know is if the carpenter's bed can be put directly on top of glass. If that works, that simplifies things even more, but uh, let's find out. No, it doesn't. Uh, that's fine. That's fine. We'll go with our other plan anyway. Uh, glass? Get just a stack of that stuff and start filling in some of these holes that I've made. Being a, being a messy lad. Where do I want to put the bed? Right over here next to the teleporters? Yeah, that makes this, that makes the most sense to me, I guess. So we will put this down. And then put the bed down on top of it. And then we got to fast travel down to here. And delicately break the blocks out from under the bed without breaking the bed itself. Excellent. Put the glass back. Look at that. We've done it. We've broken the game. The game has rules. It has regulations. We've looked at those rules and regulations and said, Shrek you, game. We'll do our own thing. Now, how do I want to style this? Do I want it to match maybe the teleporters? The teleporters look very lapis -y. Let's get some lapis blocks. We don't have any lapis blocks. Do they exist in this version of Minecraft? Thank heavens. So we can get some lapis blocks and... We can style the bed in lapis if we wanted to. Let's see how we... Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, that's spectacular. I love that. Can I change the sheet color? Possibly. Let's give this a shot. Let's see if we can... Uh, we can only sleep at night. Okay, what if we tried clicking on it with dye? I don't know if that would be a thing that works. I've never once tried it in all my life, but 
It'd be cool if it did. I mean, I, I know it works now in, in new in new mind. Oh. Oh? Have we applied the dye to the bed? We've darkened the bed a bit by doing that. That wasn't intentional. I, I don't... Uh, can, can we go back a step? Hold on, let me get some... Do we have any white? Oh, we got bone mill. Let's see what happens if we shift click bone mill on there. Let's see. Nothing. Okay. Well, now I'm just deeply confused. I've got no idea what's going on. What if I built a carpenter's bed, but I used a different color wool? I mean, it's not giving me that as an option over here. It's just showing a regular bed. But it's worth a shot. So let's get some of that. Let's get some different colored wool. Uh, let's go with light blue wool. Why not? And we'll see what happens here. No, you just get a regular bed again. So I guess there's no way to change the sheet color. And also, we've now made this one oddly darker. I don't know. I think it looks fine. I think it looks fine next to the teleporters. That's our bed. That's our mistake of a bed. I don't know how to remove the, the die. Is there a carpenter's tool for that? We've got a chisel and a hammer. I don't know if either of those would do it. Maybe maybe we'll try the hammer? What happens if we click this with a hammer? Oh! Oh, look at this! Oh my gosh! So this is left-clicking on the sheets here. And we're getting all kinds of different styles and designs. I kind of like that one. You know, we're heading into winter now. What if I right-click? Okay, so that just cycles through that. And if I hit this thing with the hammer, what if I shift-click it? There we go! Shift-clicking, shift-left-clicking right, with the hammer will get us our light blue die back. That's good to know. And then we can also do the same thing to remove the lapis. That looks fantastic. Oh my, I am, I am so... So pleased with how this turned out. I am I'm so very grateful. So a uh, big shout out there to, to whoever recommended that. Next up, we're going to come out here and grab ourselves some red matter. <laughs> we got so much of it too, which is good because we were starting to run out of uh, EMC. I want to make sure we stay topped off in here. What's the maximum did we determine? Let's just grab a few more stacks and see if it tops out at any point. I guess that's it. That's the point right there. Uh, that's a pretty hefty number. And I'm pretty oh, pretty pleased with it. We're going to make some gem armor. I don't think we need to, but I guess, you know, episode 69, feeling fine. Make some gem armor on a dime. That made no sense. So this is going to require that we get all of our red matter armor. Klein stars. Soul stones. Evan, we got to make all the jewelry. I didn't realize we had to make all the jewelry. While I am collecting things to build this armor, I just wanted to throw out there that I, I'm a bit sick. I mean, I'm sure that that's obvious, and, and many of you have already noticed based on the nasally quality of my voice and, and the fact that I occasionally do a little bit of a sniffle. Uh, I'm not too pleased about it. I, I don't like to be ill. It's just not an enjoyable experience, is it? And I hope to not be sick next time I record. I thought it was allergies, and then I thought maybe it, it wasn't because allergy pills weren't helping, but then I felt better. And I was like, oh, I, I guess it was nothing. But then it came back with like a cruel vengeance. And I've just been feeling not great ever since. So uh, I, I mean, I'm not sick feeling, you know, I don't feel tired. Like I need to go lay down or anything like that. It's not like I'm, it's just the sniffles. It's congestion. It's a real hassle. And as soon as I figure out what's causing it, you better believe I'm going to go to war with it. You know, if there's something in my body making me be sick, then it's an enemy. And it has to be confronted, and I have to do battle against it, and I will win. You know, every battle for my body I've ever fought, I have won. Otherwise, I guess I would be dead. Obvious statement. Um, do we have everything we need for the helmet, I guess? So, I suppose doing this gives us a soul stone ability, so it heals nearby players half a heart every half a second. That's on a pedestal. What does this do on pedestal? Press H for fire and water projectiles. So I guess this just implements all of this into our helmet which is kind of cool. I mean, I don't know what I'm going to do with that. I, I don't know. I don't really need any of this stuff. I, I kind of don't want any of it because I don't like the flying that's in this. That's what we talked about previously, but here we go. We built it. Ta-da. I want to blow ourselves up with a nuke and not die. That's sort of the reason we're doing this. That's, that's what's happening right now. So I've got to go through and I've got to make all these different elements and then combine them together. And then by the, the, by the power of Skull. I have, no, hold on, what does he say? How does the saying go? By the power of Grey Skull. Oh wait, was that not even used? Wasn't that supposed to be consumed in the recipe? Or was that for something different? I'm confused now. I have the power. I'll stop now. I'm sorry. 
lava projectiles stores nearby play is hunger i guess i guess that's pretty good and yeah it doesn't consume the amulets so i guess we'll be holding on to those oh you know what i need to do is i need to toss these inside of here there we go and save their states in case i want to build them again in the future uh, we're down to the legs now and the the boots boots are easy it's just a couple of swift wolves rending gales i wanted to see if this is all shapeless and uh, i can't confirm that it is the boots, or I'm sorry, the leggings are going to require that we build a black hole band. It was easier to say than it was to... No, it was easier to do than it was to say. That was that was insanely simple. Gym boots, there we go. And then uh, combine that with a watch of flowing time, I think. And that's it, so... Oh, right, I, I, I'll do it. No, no, there's no problem, game. I'll, I'll manually drag these things in there. That's, that's fine by me. What else was I missing? The watch? There we go. Gym leggings. A uh, good guy, Jim Leggings. Me and him were friends in high school. Very, very decent fella. Uh, shame about what happened to him. Okay, let's suit up. There we, there we are. That's what I look like. And uh, we can, we have creative flight now. But you know, descending is like you know, you're, you're trying to destroy the Earth. This is, this is what the the Ultron wanted. He wanted to lift whatever that country was into the sky, and then. Slap it back down to the ground. Uh, we can move really fast now, which is kind of cool. And if we jump, not fly, but if we jump, and we just hold down the jump button instead of double clicking, we can fly stupid far, stupid fast. But, I don't know. You don't have a lot of control over it. Because you hold down space to go up. And then in order to go back down, you gotta you gotta kind of let... I mean, look, we're, we're still... I'm looking in that direction, but that's not the direction we're flying in. I think I have to like touch down. There we go. And then sort of recenter ourselves before we can start flying in the direction we want. It's not great. I'll say that. Uh, you can't go side to side too, but it takes a while for it to actually, you know, change directions. Oh my gosh. See what I mean? See what I mean? You can just easily miss your, your mark. But we all know what we have to do next. We got to take a uh, some TNT. We'll just grab a stack of nukes there. And we'll need to grab ourselves something to light those with. So maybe just some red matter torches. Uh, not Ted Matter. Ted Matter is a different thing. We want, we want, can we not, can we even light them with red matter? I don't know. I know we can with a lover. So let's grab one of those. And we'll head to the place where we do all these sorts of experiments. Uh, the volcano. Because it's already pretty gross. I mean, how much worse can it get? I mean, there's a, cr dang it. See, this, gah, useless. We're just going to use regular vanilla Minecraft flying now. This is, this is creative flight. You can still do creative flight by double clicking on the space button which is useful um so i guess we'll head down here into the the depths of the lava i'm pretty sure we're fireproof now like i don't i don't think we can be hurt by it yeah we're fine um so we'll just head down here to the base of this and we'll throw down some nukes we like that and Just kind of stand here, wait and see what happens. One of these is going to go off first. I guess this one. Cool. We're going to be at ground zero. We're just going to watch this happen. Any second now. Just got to have a bit of patience. Are you kidding me? Seriously? We had red matter armor. Are you for real right now? Red matter armor! What? It was gym! It wasn't even red matter, it was gym armor! We had on gym armor! It's even more ludicrous! Thank you folks for watching. Thank you for your support. Twitch.tv forward slash howdy folks live. Link in the description. See y'all in the next one. Bye. <laughs>